guys. And if you don't, you certainly should, and you should go down and like this channel, Mr. James R. Burns. Hello. <laughs> Hi, mate. So I, I don't even know, I'm just out walking the dog. So this, believe me, this is him. This is Mr. James R. Burns. How you doing, mate? <laughs> How you doing? All right, job. So if you watch Chris's channel, you'll know that he does a series of quickfire questions and I thought I'd get my own back on him and have my own quickfire questions for him. So how are you feeling about this, Chris? Are you feeling the pressure? I, I am feeling the pressure, John. All right, okay, so let's get started, okay? You ready? I'm ready. Okay, long exposure or capture the moment? Definitely long exposure. UV or no UV? No UV. Photoshop or Lightroom? Lightroom. YouTube or book? YouTube. Foreground or background? Background. Portrait or landscape orientation? Landscape. And Instagram or Vero? Vero, I think. There we go. How do you feel about that? Yeah, it was good. It was fun, wasn't it? Have you recorded? Yes, I've recording. done a money. I am recording. I haven't done a money. Hey. Hey. Yes. This thing's terrible. It's getting better, but what do you use? Premier. Yeah. I'm messing that with, might be what? I'm messing with transitions. Oh, no, I don't mean it like that. Like Premiere for me is just an extension yeah. Yeah. of working in that kind of environment. I enjoy, it's video. I enjoy using Premiere like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. If I threw away my wide angle lens, that's probably 95% of my shots gone. So I'm not just here with Paul, I'm also here with his lovely wife, Denise. And she's currently got crabs. I'm with John in the background. You might recognise John. John has well. John has a um, a Facebook group, and it's called Landscape Photography on YouTube UK. That's right. Correct. Okay. Uh, it's a bit of a mouthful. Before we get going, why is it so confusing to say? Why is it such a <laughs> mouthful? Why can't you think of a name shorter that we could all understand? I never get it wrong. It's, it's it's easy. <laughs> to be fair, I suppose if everybody gets it wrong, everybody will talk about it. So there you go. Exactly. Uh, right. Okay. So I'm here with John this week. Uh, John has very kindly uh, offered me the opportunity to take a picture that will be used for a calendar. And uh, it's actually October now. And it's going to be used, hopefully, as long as we don't mess up tonight, it's going to be used for next October's calendar, but it's not any old calendar. It's uh, a very special calendar and it's for a charity to raise money for a very serious cause. Um, John, tell us a bit about it. Yeah, so the charity is for Louis and basically it's a charity um, for parents who've lost children. Um, it's close to my heart and I thought the, the group's doing absolutely fantastic. We've got challenges every month. Um, why not try and raise some money out of it? So we're doing the charity calendar, the challenge, win the challenge winners of every month's competition are going to have each month in it and then Gary's going to have October so it's going to be absolutely fantastic and 100% of profits are going to go to the 4 Louis charity.
there's obviously rain coming and I've caught it just at the right time. The storm is in the sky, the clouds are dark. It's a decent location. There's lots of rocks, lots of leading lines. I just... I don't know. I used to think that photography was kind of... Once you got your settings right, it was pretty easy. And that if you took a good photo, if you had an eye for it, you'd be okay. There's definitely something else. Um, it's not motivation, although it feels like it. It's kind of creativity. And it's difficult to explain. And you only realise when you lose it. I've not been feeling very creative. Hi John, Rachel Lurch from Canada saying hello and I have a challenge for you. I would like to see what kind of photography you can come up with using only a prime lens. Can't wait to see. See ya. Photography. It's about climbing new heights, seeing the possibilities, discovering your strength and joy, capturing the passion and letting the landscape leave a print of inspiration on your soul. Rachel, come with me. Let's learn an adventure together.